Hi guys, welcome back to another little Geek Reviews. This time we're going to go through the fourth and final turtle, Michelangelo. Looking a bit crazy with this version, he's got that little blonde wig thing going on. <laughs> Round the actual back, you've got him there without the wig, thank God. <laughs> but he's in, uh, he's in the fright zone with fighting Hordak. And he's got this um, build and collect type of figure going on in the cage there. The Roboto or something or, or other. Haven't actually got any of the wave where you do build this type of figure yet. I don't know whether I'm going down, like I say, I don't know whether I'm going down the whole route of the turtle line. But if I do end up getting them, I'm sure you'll see the review on them on this channel. So let's crack him open and get a little closer look. So getting him out of the box he comes with a newer comic. I don't know what this one is actually called because there has got no speech bubbles or anything within this one. But you've got Splinter in this story. You've got April O'Neil. Can't wait for her to come out. She is on pre-order. You've got Mutated Merman in this comic as well. And obviously Skeletor. Looking good. But getting to the actual figure of Mikey. He comes in this vibrant green and orange. Obviously they're taking it from the battle armour He-Man. But this time he's got the big letter M there on his chest. On his back, he comes with the usual shield where you can put his little weapons, accessories. So he comes with little nunchucks, so you can slide them down the back there. But we'll have a little closer look at them in detail in a moment. This little, you can see it wobbling now, this little disco wig. So th thank God this actually pops off. Because this is some type of horrific. <laughs> now that we've got shut of that wig, you can see his face a hell of a lot more clearly. I love the big cheesy grin you have got on Mikey here. I love this actual face meld. Well, cool. Now, with that wig popping off, does his bandana turn? like all the others little bit stiff but yeah it does turn on mine which is dead good let's while we're here let's do the accessories he's got these little nunchucks now getting them out of the pack some of the plastic on mine is actually welded together where some isn't so I don't know, I don't want to try and force this in case it breaks. But all these little links from one side are all separate. And then these three links on this side are stuck together. And like I say, I don't want to jiggle it too much. In case it breaks, it's the think it's the same on this one. You've got some of the links there are separated, but then there's m more links. It's literally from the middle, so you've got one, two, three, four plastic links that are bonded. So you see. Oh, they'll just slide into his hands because he's got two both gripper hands and there he is like so now his shield it's the same thing it does pop off and there's two little peggies on his armor there 
and articulation does all the same as all the other origins and we know from this little guide that everything does pop off so you can like modular and mix and match everything that you may wish while I've just popped that arm off let's take the armor detailing off and let's see what he looks like without I actually thought this chest plate would have come off with the actual uh, vibrant orange type of armor but that is his actual body plate there as well it's funny how they've done that with it not being the whole um, battle armor he-man look with it just being flat so I thought it would have been like a um, the Fisto type of armor where it could have just clicked off. But other than that, I like I say, I really love the detail on them, except for this wig piece. <laughs> I mean, I'm even putting that on right. It covers all of his eyes as well. But there you go. There is Michelangelo. Let me know your thoughts in the comments box on this. What do you think of this line? While you're there, drop on those comments. Do the usual with like, subscribe, tickle that little bell notification so you don't miss out on any others. But thanks for checking in on this one, and I will see you on the next. Take care.